Hey everyone, Melissa here. Today's look will be created using the Lola New York Chic Collection. This set comes with a cream blush in St. Tropez, an eyeshadow trio, an eyeliner pencil in brown, mascara in black, and this really cool lipstick that actually has a mirror attached with it. Um, the set all comes in this cute little cosmetic bag with um, a keychain lip gloss so you can take it everywhere you need to be. So I hope you enjoy today's look. After you've applied your foundation, the first step to achieve New York Chic is our cream blush. We're going to use Lola's Cream Blush in St. Tropez and I'm going to use a sponge applicator and I'm just going to put that on the end of the sponge like so and then exactly where you would normally apply your brush you're just going to stipple this on starting at the apple of your cheek and working up into the hairline and you need to just blend the color out so that you don't have any streaks or harsh edges when you finish and the color may appear to be a little darker cream blush sometimes is but once you set the color with your powder, it won't look as intense. So you can control the intensity, one, by how much you apply, and two, once you set everything in place with your powder. Before we start our eyes, I'm going to use the technique that I like, and that's to apply some of my translucent powder underneath my eye to avoid fallout. So when we start our eyeshadow look, we have the Lola palette, and it's a trio, and we're going to start with the goldenrod color in the top corner. And with this, I'm going to apply it all over the lid of the eye. Okay, next, we're going to go in with our angled shadow brush and the brown color in the palette. And with this color, I'm going to use it on the outer corner of the eye and along the crease line. One way to enhance your natural beauty is to make the natural shadowing on your face a little more intense. And one of those areas is the crease of the eye. And it really just helps make your eyes pop. It adds some dimension. And so we're going to make it the darkest in the crease and then blend it up so that it's slightly lighter as we get higher up onto the lid of the eye. Next, I'm going to go in with my same brush and I'm going to use the purple color here. And I'm going to go over the brown a little bit, just up to the crease. I'm not going to go up as high as I did with the brown color. Okay, and then to blend it all in, I'm not going to use any color, but I'm going to just use a loose feather br uh, shadow brush and just kind of blend it up so that you don't have any harsh lines. Okay, that takes care of the eyeshadow. Now we're going to use the fine line pencil that's in the palette and it's just a chocolate brown now that we've lined the entire eye I'm going to go back over that line with my smudging brush and the brown color here in the palette so just go underneath right over top of that line to enhance the color of the liner and soften the line as well because this is a great daytime look and you don't want any harsh lines when you're out during the day. Okay, so we have our eyeshadow done. Next we're going to go in with the Lola Ultimate Mascara and this is the black color. Two coats is all you need. Now that we've finished our cheeks and our eyes, all we need now is our lipstick. And this palette comes with a lip sheer in 
Pink Panther. Color. It's a very velvety formula, I would say. And what we're going to do is go back over top of it with this little lip gloss that has the keychain on it. And this is the color Enchantress. Now that we've completed our lipstick, that completes the entire New York Chic look. Thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and I'll see you next time.